In this tutorial, you will learn how to delete mysterious other data from your iPhone. iTunes is where most people are first introduced to the mysterious other capacity, and it's by far the most direct way to see how much stored data is labeled that way. Connect an iOS device to iTunes to see the yellow other number. If it's under one gigabyte, you probably don't have much to concern yourself with. But if it starts taking up several gigabytes of storage on a 16 gigabyte device, it can be very annoying, and that's the type of capacity issue that we'll focus on reclaiming here. Delete and reinstall apps with bloated local data. Go to Settings, General, and look under Usage. Look at the largest apps and compare the documents and data size to the actual app size. These are what you should focus on for removal and reinstallation. Keep in mind that deleting apps and reinstalling them this way may cause you to lose local data, be it saved games, saved app caches, and certain app-specific data and files, so you wouldn't want to do this with apps that have locally stored data that is important for you. Remove large messages and threads. Open messages and tap Edit. Select the message that you want to delete and tap Delete. Repeat as necessary. Clear Safari cookies and data. Open Settings, then go to Safari and tap on Clear Cookies Data and History. Deleting voice memos. Open voice memos. Tap Edit. Tap on the memo to delete, and then tap the red delete button. Once you've done all the steps above, you should restart the iOS device so that it effectively recalculates the usage data. Connect it again to iTunes or check the usage stats again from settings. If you have done all the above and the other space is still too large to make sense of, you may need to just back up and restore the device. This basically reinstalls iOS while preserving your data. And in the process, it can help clear out a lot of junk that accumulated to create the humongous other space. 